Keep watching to see the story of Judy, the only dog officially recognized as a prisoner of war in World War II, and viewed as a guardian angel, and symbol of hope and courage, for thousands of Allied troops imprisoned and tortured by the Japanese in the Far East. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and hit the bell notification so you'll know every time I upload a new video. Judy was a ship's dog on board HMS Nat and HMS Grasshopper stationed on the Yangtze before and during World War II. She proved able to hear incoming aircraft, providing the crew with an early warning. After part of the crew transferred from the Nat to the Grasshopper in June 1939 the ship was sent to Singapore after the British declaration of war on Germany. There she was on board the ship during the Battle of Singapore, which saw Grasshopper evacuate for the Dutch East Indies. It was sunk en route, and Judy was nearly killed having been trapped by a falling row of lockers. She was rescued when a crewman returned to the stricken vessel looking for supplies. On the deserted island with the surviving crew, Judy managed to find a fresh water source saving them all. They made their way to Sinkep in the Dutch East Indies and afterwards to Sumatra aiming to link up with the evacuating British forces. After trekking across 200 miles of jungle for five weeks, during which Judy survived an attack from a crocodile, the crew arrived a day after the final vessel had left and subsequently became prisoners of war of the Japanese. She was eventually smuggled into the Glo Goa prisoner of war camp in Maidan, where she met leading aircraftsman Frank Williams for the first time, who she would go on to spend the rest of her life with. Williams convinced the camp commandant to register her as an official prisoner of war, with the number 81 A Glogor made on. She was the only dog to be registered as a prisoner of war during the Second World War. She moved around several more camps, and survived the sinking of the transport ship SS Van Warwick where in the aftermath she saved several passengers from drowning. Lace Earl from the Grasshopper smuggled her once again into the next camp, where she was reunited with Frank Williams. After the end of the war, Judy's life was put in danger once again. She was about to be put to death by the Japanese guards following a lice outbreak amongst the prisoners. However, Williams hid the dog until the Allied forces arrived. Searle, Williams, and others smuggled Judy back to the UK aboard a troop ship and she spent the next six months in quarantine after arriving. She was awarded the Dickin Medal by the PDSA, considered to be the animal's Victoria Cross. Judy died in 1950 in Tanzania from a tumor, after traveling with Williams there to work on a ground nut food scheme. Her Dickin medal and collar were subsequently put on display at the Imperial War Museum in Duxford as part of the Animals Fair exhibition. If you found this video informative or entertaining please give it a like, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification so you'll never miss a video from us. Thank you for watching.